Did you design these? You're the guy that everybody's been talking about. I really gotta get them out of here. Wait, uh, uh, what? Uh, what? This movie, of course, gives Cinderella vibes. Did you ever watch Cinderella when you were growing up or did you pull from any like childhood memories filming this movie? Yeah, for sure. Um, I think my first memory was the original, the animated one. And then I think just over the years, you, you see every every iteration that comes out. And uh, that's the beauty of Disney. They, they have such a catalog of movies that transcend generations. I was obsessed with Cinderella growing up. I was obsessed with all fairy tales growing up. And I think that it's important now that we tell stories where we see black and brown people just existing, where there's no stereotype or stigma attached. And it's a main reason kind of why I did this uh, for representation specifically for my community and for young black girls to see themselves in this light. It was every shade of black you can possibly think inside this movie from the darkest of dark skins to the lightest of light skin, but still blackity black. And I think it was important to show that it doesn't make a difference where you come from. Your dreams will take you wherever you want to be. That's my dream. We need to dominate. Sneaker con, we need something big. We need a new voice, someone fresh. I have to ask you too as well, because it's a sneaker movie, do you have a favorite sneaker drop? I, the crazy thing is in the movie, the sneakers that we're talking about that I'm dropping, I wore in 1985. At that time, I was crazy about Adidas. I'm an Air Force guy, so I love Ooh. classic Air Force. Um, I love the Air Force Shibuyas, which were a really cool drop that I liked. Um, yeah, if you see me, you're gonna probably see me in the Air Force most likely. I would definitely say any pair of Jordans, specifically the Mochas. They're kind of like a new release, but brown is my favorite color. I wear earth tones like it's nobody's business. So like those mochas are constantly a go-to for me. They're like just so fly, I love them. Now I'm vegan. I'm crazy about shoes that don't have animal products on them or don't have animal products in them. And I'm working really hard with a company while waiting on this negotiation with this company out of Portugal um, to literally hopefully get involved with these sneak with these kicks. If you put enough of yourself into a design, it's gonna hit. Once I slip on that sneaker, it's my story.